Alright, well... Let's see who needs talking to. Let's start with the... Hadley. The Joker. Fields. Any news on your brother? He's gone. They're all gone. But we'll get them back. Shepard and Lawson are on it. Okay, Shepard. Glad you're back. But keep an eye on that last one. We can only hold so much crazy. I assume everything's going well up here? I really want a chance to put the Normandy through her paces. I just have to trim up the drive output and it'll be like we never lost her. Safety standards advise against manipulating drive settings while engines are powered and in use, Mr. Moreau. Commander, can we shut this thing off? I don't need it in my day-to-day. -day. I don't have time to babysit you, Joker. Find a way to deal with it. Yeah, reasoning with the intercom is not my strong point. Your problem, not mine. Thanks, I'll remember this. That's it for now. See you, Commander. <laughs> Deal with it. In short. Right. <clears throat> right. Hello. Commander, can I help you with something? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. Sounds good. Have to say you run this ship tight, and we're getting things done. We keep on track, and maybe we'll figure this out. I hope so. I'm not looking forward to the debrief if it all goes to hell. Is there something specific? Or are you just checking in? My ship, my time. I just want to talk. Informal, huh? Everything's in my file. Ex-Alliance like you, no Reapers or anything, but I got swept under the rug, too. The more good you do, the less they want to admit that something needed doing. What was your proudest career moment? The job I'm proudest of wasn't for the Alliance. Nobody really knows about it. A Batarian group was plotting to release a weaponized virus and kill the Council. Miranda and I stopped it. Strange that it wasn't bigger news. The real work doesn't get publicized, you know that. They say it's better that people don't know how fragile the system is or how close the bad guys can get. So, it never happened. Like you and the Reaper. And that's why I'm here. What led you to Cerberus? The Alliance sidelined me after Eden Prime. Ended up on a job with Miranda that Cerberus treated like an audition. And here I am. You don't seem like a results-at-all-costs kind of guy. Cerberus history doesn't bother you? The Alliance is all politics. Somebody has to take down the bad people. Cerberus keeps that line, I'm on their side. You make no apologies for doing what you had to. I admire that. I couldn't go back to the Alliance, not after the cover-up. They did the same to you. General Public never knew you were dead or heard the real story of the Citadel. Did you know they used you on recruitment ads? You were the human ideal for like six months. Then they replaced you with a composite image they invented. Guess you didn't focus test right. Perfect example of humanity and they still dumped you. Uh, are you always this depressing? <laughs> Way to boil it down, Jacob. I hope you keep a better attitude about our current mission. Don't worry. This is exactly what I signed on for. If that's all, Commander, I'll get back to my duties. There's a lot to get ready. Right. Yay! Two rem oh, I got two Paragon. Fuck off. Uh... No, I'm pretty sure I... Or did I? Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Yes, would like that, actually. Talked about work earlier, time with special tasks group, studying genophage. It wasn't entirely honest. Lie of omission. Also, other kinds need to clear the air. Mission too important to keep secrets. Work on genophage was more than just study. I had a feeling you were holding something back. Apologies, classified information, but you've earned the full story. Need to know me, what I can do, what I did. Wasn't lying completely. Initially, just did recon, but... Uncovered data. Troubling. Krogan population was increasing at faster rate than expected. Krogan were adapting to genophage, overcoming disease. Ah. Did the Krogan evolve, or did some of their scientists develop a treatment? Krogan scientists? <laughs> Never met Krogan scientists worthy of term. No. Natural evolution. Krogan physiology incredibly durable. Organ redundancy, backup systems, cellular regeneration. Genophage like any other natural hazard. Krogan evolved past it. Maybe they were just having a lucky year. Or fewer mercs left, meaning more Krogan were left to repopulate. Please, Shepard. Social environmental concerns accounted for. Not an undergraduate. 
Population spike caused by adaptation to genophage. No other possibility. So you say, but uh, you never know. In the words of uh, the almighty Ian Malcolm, life will find a way. The Krogan are dangerous enough already. With an unchecked birth rate, they could endanger the whole galaxy. Exactly. Salarian government agreed, authorized STG to take steps. Personally led a science team. Geneticists, chemists, sociologists, mathematicians. Created new version of genophage. Released it onto Chanka, other Krogan-centric areas. Restabilized Krogan population. If the Krogan are so dangerous, why not just sterilize them outright? Not a war criminal. Not a murderer. Genocide. Unnecessary. Krogan as a whole, violent, aggressive, still have outliers worth saving. Genophage modification protected galaxy allowed Krogan chance to survive. Everyone wins. Good for us, good for them. Ah. You were protecting galactic stability. I'm glad to see you were willing to do what was necessary. Indeed. Collectors doing horrific things may face hard choices. Wanted you to know I'm willing to do what's necessary. Should get back to work. Talk more later. Next time, tissue synthesis has to compile. Good for free time. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for the six renegade, though, anyway. Right. No messages for you, Commander. Thank you. <clears throat> Let's see. That one's closed. People are talking out there, and I hear it all. What the fuck? That painting has a special place in my heart. An art collector hired me to steal it. When I got there, the painting was gone. On the way out, I saw it being hauled off by another thief. I chased him down, tackled him, and took the painting. That's how KG and I met. We never did turn it into our employers. Right. The Red Rose. That used to be my calling card when I first started out. In place of whatever I took, I left a single Red Rose. It wasn't until I met KG that I realized how silly it was. He had a way of making you realize when you were just being sentimental. I stole that on a dare, believe it or not. There was a big museum show coming to Ilium. Artifacts from Earth going on tour. Very high security. KG dared me to steal this, so I broke in. Hacked the security, put a few guards to sleep, and replaced the piece with a worthless duplicate. They never knew the difference. My first museum job. Nowhere near the last. You know, usually, <clears throat> pride is a strictly male thing. That's my favorite piece, painted for me by a child prodigy from Elysium. She was the cutest thing. She was kidnapped by slavers who hoped to sell her on Omega. I wasn't about to let that happen. I set up an idea as a buyer's rep to get a special tour of the slaver's vessel. Once aboard, I freed the girl and smuggled her off the ship. She painted that for me on the way home. I'll never forget how it felt to watch her work. Don't laugh, I like those books. Romance novels, crime novels, the classics. There's something about the feel of actual paper in your hands, their musty smell. It's relaxing. Keiji used to find books for me while on the job. Some of these are more valuable than the objects he was hired to steal. Oh, that's good to know. Nothing over. That's a bathroom. Actually, a shower. Same thing. Uh. Wait. Rupert, there's something different with tonight's meal. Seems like you put in more food and less ass. Yeah, yeah, keep talking. <laughs> More food than I said. Nice. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got any upgrade ideas for the Normandy's weapon systems? A few, yeah. Here, take a look. Take a look. Oh, Thonic Scanner. Goodbye, 15,000 Platinum. Ah, 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 ah. Nice. Shepard, need me for something? Ooh. 
What can you tell me about the Normandy's armaments? The weapons upgrades have gone in beautifully. This thing packs a hell of a punch. It just might give us a chance against the Collectors. Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Uh, you and the fucking calibrations. Fine. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. Well, shit, I needed you now. Don't you be turning your back on me. On me! <laughs> what about you? Commander, what can I do for you? Have you got any ideas for potential upgrades we could make? A few ideas, yeah. Here, yeah, take a look. Ship enhancements. Advanced mineral scanner. Oh, iridium this time. Good. I have a shitload of death. Commander, what can I do for you? Do you have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to do, Shepard. Maybe another time. Seriously? I'll let you work. Of course, Commander. Nobody wants to talk to me. What the hell? On the other hand, I got myself some uh, advanced mineral scanners. Yup. Yup, yup, yup. Uh, where am I going? This way. This way. Light. Thinking about past missions. Got a minute? You might learn something. Oh yeah. That's a model of the Varicon. Turian frigate. Hell of a ship. I led a mission to bring that thing down from the inside with just five men and whatever guns we could bring. No chance of success, but we did it. Everyone died but me. So I made out like a bandit. My first impossible mission as an independent contractor. There's been many since, but nothing so goddamn sweet as watching that Turian warship crash planet side. I love this guy's stories. Hey, don't touch. That rifle's older than you are. I call her Jessie. That's my lucky charm. More men have been killed with that gun than died in the Skillian Blitz. The day I laid her to rest was the saddest day of my life. I give up every weapon I own for one more mission with that shitty old rifle. Sentimentality. Right. Beauty, isn't it? Pride that off the Krogan warlord, Kazak. Used to run the blood pack out of Omega about 17 years ago. Wasn't even a job. The guy just thought he'd hijack a freighter I was hitchhiking on. Big mistake. I goaded Kazak into one-on-one -on -one combat. Took out his legs, grabbed his gun, and killed every blood pack bastard in the room. That was the most beaten Krogan I've ever seen. Kept the helmet to remind me of that pained expression. You're a real fucking asshole, you know that? Where? Crash compactor. What? Oh my god! Oh my fucking god! Look at that! Amazing technology! <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Garrus put some crazy tech into the main guns. It's almost doubled their power draw. But they seem pretty wicked. Indeed. Don't worry. A few tweaks to the forward capacitors, and the balance is back in line. If you say so, laddie. I'm sorry, but my, uh... British accent sucks fucking donkey dick. Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. I'm still finding out about me. Thanks for letting me look at these files. What's in them? Your friends at Cerberus are into some nasty things. I'm gonna find something I can use. I just know it. What if the answers aren't what you expect? I'm not looking for answers. I'm looking for names, dates, places. What happens when you find what you're looking for? I go hunting. Anyone who's screwed with me pays. Their associates pay. Their friends pay. The galaxy is going to be a lot emptier when I'm done. Yeah. What's your history with Cerberus? They raised me in a research facility. I escaped when I was a kid. Been on the run ever since. And they've been chasing me ever since. 
but soon I'm gonna chase them. You sound a little bit too excited about that. You think about this a lot, don't you? I go to sleep with this. I wake up with it. Everyone I kill, I pretend it's the ones that did this to me. Uh-huh. I should go. Yep. Oh no, she said it. She said it. I should go. <laughs> oh god damn it, Shepard. I I thought we were all over that. Uh this way? Yes, this way. Oh fuck. I'm pretty sure the fish are dead. Pretty fucking sure they're dead. Yup! Ah, oh, god damn it. God damn it. <laughs> Squeak! <laughs> Squeak! Nice. Right. Um. Well, apparently no one wants to talk to me. So, yeah. Well, almost no one. No messages for you, Commander. Yes, thank you. I'm... Obviously. So. What do we want to do next? Uh... Recruit the... Zakhogan? Zakhogan? Sure. Why not? Actually... Why not check out the MSV's Rosalie? Rosalie! Yes. Ponto. I like the name. Uh -huh. Ooh. Let's see... MSV Rosalie... Oh, look at the rings! So pretty in the sky! Right... Yes, give me the platinum, yeah. Probe launched. Launching probe. Launched. 
probe launched. Probe away. Launching probe. That's a decent amount of platinum, I think. Probe. Mostly lots and lots and lots of iridium. Anomaly detected. No shit. Come on with the fucking platinum, anything. Platinum. My kingdom for some platinum already. Come on. Come on. No? Really? Holy mother of God. Probe away. That was. Uh... Launching probe. I have found something. Of course you have. Let's go. Just to update their uh, fucking what's it called abilities. Concussive shot, heavy concussive shot. Uh, nah. Jacque, see, this is the problem with uh, biotic followers. They just don't have any damaging abilities. Still not sure about the AI hacking though. I don't really encounter that many geth in this game. Right. So if plasma, shotgun, phalanx, vindicator, what? <clears throat> oh, 
Well, it's, at least it's not a fucking Mako. Which is the fucking... God fucking damn it. This is embarrassing, okay. I apologize. Uh, oh my fucking... Sorry about this. It handles better than the Mako, I can tell you that much. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. I always do. Uh, error, invalid sender name, really. Well... Uh... Yay, Hammerhead. Don't really know why all the vehicles are named after sharks, but... Uh, whatever. Anyway, right. Uh, need to go shake hands with the president It will be a very long handshake, but when I come back, I think uh, we'll go recruit uh, the Kogan warlord. Yes Good 
Yeah.